basically I come from Great Britain. I was born in Manchester. I stayed in England till 1991, then I moved to Belgium uh, and I worked together with Ludo Philipparts. And then from there I started my own business in 2000 and 2014 moved to the States. In Wellington we have a farm with 25 acres. We still maintain a farm in, in, in Belgium with uh, 20 horses and so what we do, we produce the horses there and when they get to a certain age to come to become commercial here, we bring them over. I like to take a, a rider that's not so well known or and a young rider and produce them a little bit and, and that way they get to ride a lot of horses, get a lot of experience. I think for the market, the people can also see that these people are riding the horses they're the same as my customers. I started riding when I was very young. Watching my parents do it day in and day out, there was no doubt in my mind that this is what I wanted to do. Just last year, I was approached by Neil about a possible riding job with him and started working for him in September. I grew up in horse business. My mom is a professional equestrian. She has her own business in Seattle. So the minute I could go on a horse, I was, I was on one. I went to ride at the University of Georgia on the equestrian team. After I graduated, I turned professional and worked for Eric Lamaz and Ben Mayer and now Neil Jones. It's a different side to the business than it is just to produce a young horse or train clients. And I get along quite well with his personality. He's always in a great mood and he's positive and he is confident in your abilities. Neil's great. He's, uh, he's got a great sense of humor. He's very dedicated to the sport and I think he is truly passionate, passionate about the horses. When he has great riders like Natasha or myself riding for him, and it makes it uh, easy for us all to kind of work together and, and produce good results. Some of my successes are not just only with my horses that were competing with us, but horses that had sold and they've gone on and competed in the Olympics and things like that. And most of my people are repeat customers that have had, and so we get a lot of references from them. The horses Neil has are all different levels and also different types, which is great to have in a dealing barn because uh, not everybody rides the same or prefers the same horse. The common theme of all the horses is they're all easy enough and enjoyable to ride so that anybody can get on, no matter what their preference of horse is. I think we're very accommodating in the fact that we let people try the horses in the ring. We're very flexible if the people want to try them, if they want to lease them, and if they want to buy them and there's a problem, I'm here. The good thing is that I have a, a stock of horses, so if they want to try something, there's a variation of horses. I think for Neil, it's, it's given me so much opportunity to ride different horses and, and um, get so much more experience in the ring. So I think my riding has grown a lot because I've been able to ride different horses, different types, and develop more um, mileage in the ring. What keeps me going, I, I think that my job's not really a job, it's, it's more of a hobby that I've turned into a job and I really enjoy doing my work and I'm enjoying working now with Natasha Traurig and then Carly Anthony. Good young people that are really trying to do well and, and enjoy the work just as much as I do. I think he's always looking out for your best interest and uh, wants the best for you. The individual can trust Neil and that he truly wants to set you up with a suitable mount for what you're looking for. For first time Neil Jones buyers, I don't think it's going to take much convincing. Um, they'll be coming into a very welcoming, friendly group of people. I think they're, they're going to be in good hands.